everybody and welcome back to Staffordshire Library's big family reading quiz. So I have the all important answers now. So are we ready? Okay. Question one. What is the address for Harry Potter when he is living with the Dursleys in the cupboard under the stairs? It is for Privet Drive. Question two. In the diary of a wimpy kid, who is Greg's older brother? It is Roderick. Question three. In the classic children's book, The Wind in the Willows, what does Toad disguise himself as to escape from jail? He disguises as a washerwoman. Question four. Tom Gates goes to which school? It's Oakfield School. Question five. Name the four children who go through the wardrobe into the land of Narnia in The Lion, the Witch and the Wardrobe. It is, of course, Peter, Susan, Lucy and Edmund. Question six. What is the name of the teen spy created by top author Anthony Horowitz? It is Alex Ryder. Question seven. What is the first book in the Percy Jackson series called by Rick Baradorian? The Lightning Thief. In The Hunger Games, sorry, question eight. In The Hunger Games, who is Katniss Everdeen's younger sister? It is Primrose. Question nine. Who does Charlie take into the chocolate factory in Charlie and the Chocolate Factory by Roald Dahl? It is, of course, Grandpa Joe. Question 10. Who is the author of these books? Awful Auntie, Bad Dad, Mr Stink. It is David Williams. Question 11. In How to Train Your Dragon by Cressida Cal, what type of dragon is toothless? He is Night Fury. Question 12. What is the name of the horse in the classic book War Horse by Michael Monpurgo? Was Joey. Question 13. J.R. Tolkien created Bilbo Baggins, but what kind of creature is he? He is, of course, a hobbit. And our last question, question 14. Who is the current children's laureate? It is Cressida Cowell, who is the author of the fabulous How to Train Your Dragon series, as well as many more. So, how did you do? I hope you enjoyed yourself. Please, please feel free to comment and post below with your scores and everything. And I hope you've enjoyed yourself and I hope you're still in your pyjamas. Keep reading. Take care, everybody. Bye-bye.